Hey guys, and Tony here. Today I'm going to be talking about a very wonderful concert that I went to last night live from the Berliner Philharmonica. This starred the musical trio Prisma Kammer Musik. Now, this is a trio of very, very talented male musicians. The first one is a violinist, the second one is a cellist, and the third one is a pianist. Now, before the actual concert began, there was an introduction that was made by some gentleman that I forgot his name, and he was talking about some very interesting facts about three of the greatest classical composers, Joseph Haydn, Franz Schubert, and Ludwig van Beethoven. Not only was he talking about bits and pieces of their biography, but he was also talking about the time that they were living in, and certain musical terminologies like Allegro, Andante, Presto, and he gave a definition for each of those words and played us a few musical samples. Now, this is the first time that I went to the Berliner Philharmonica, and as I entered the concert hall, I was immediately amazed at how beautiful it was. Seriously, I loved it. I really appreciated just the mere beauty of being in a concert hall, watching three very talented musicians just do their thing. Now, let's get to the musicians themselves, which are probably the greatest part about this concert and you know to tell you the truth I I was not familiar with them back then I never really knew who they were until now so let's get to that and don't worry I have my program with me just in case I mess up any names or mess up any facts then I will always refer to this so, let's get started. On the violin, there is Kolja Blacher, who hails from Berlin, Germany. And here's something interesting. He has studied in Juilliard for 15 years. And he has worked with other conductors like... Claudia Abado, Alan Gilbert, Daniel Harding, Vladimir Yurovsky, and Markus Stenz. And also worked with other orchestras like the Mallard Chamber Orchestra and the Melbourne Symphony Orchestra. Quite an interesting background he has. Now let's move on to the cellist, Clemens Hagen who hails all the way from Salzburg, Austria. Now, interesting fact. He was born in a very musical family and has played the cello ever since he was six years old. He has worked with the Wiener Philharmonica, the Kamerata Salzburg, Chamber Orchestra of Europe, the Cleveland Orchestra, and also the NHK Symphony Orchestra in Tokyo, and has worked with conductors such as Nikolaus Hanoncourt, Ingo Metzmacher, and Sylvain Camberling. And I would really, really love to comment on how he was playing his instrument. I could really feel that he gave his heart and soul to just performing th with this instrument. And it really shows 
that, yeah, a lot of training and discipline can go far. So, yeah, I would pretty much have to say he was my favorite out of the three. Finally, we have the pianist, Kirill Gerstein. He is from Russia. And here's an interesting fact. He has studied in the Berklee College of Music in Boston for 14 years and has worked with the BBC Symphony Orchestra, the Chicago Symphony Orchestra, and the New York Philharmonic Orchestra. Excuse me. And he was also a prize winner of the, how they say in German, Otto Rubinstein Wettbewerbs that he won in Tel Aviv, Israel in 2001. Now, all I can say that this is a very, very, very wonderful trio of musicians. Not just wonderful, but very interesting. And I could really see that these three gents have really given it their all, and all I have to say is I am really wowed by their performances. Now, further details will come once I discuss the pieces that they played that night. Now, the first piece that they played was Joseph Haydn's Piano Trio in A Natural. Now, this has three movements. Allegro moderato, moderato, excuse me, andante, and allegro. Now, I thought they played all three movements very beautifully, and I really have nothing else to say with that. I mean, I just thought they did such a fantastic job playing this wonderful piece of music from probably one of the greatest classical composers to ever exist. Now here is my favorite part before the intermission began. Ludwig van Beethoven's Piano Trio in D Natural, or how the Germans call it, D Dua. We start off with Allegro Vivace e con Brio, all I can say that it was such an energetic, it was just so energetic. It was really energetic. I really loved this first movement, and I can't help but smile. Now the second movement, Largo Asai e Despresivo, almost sounds like a mysterious little lullaby that you could play to your child when he's sleeping. And the last chords really sell it, of how mysterious and quite somber, I may say, the whole movement is. And finally we have Presto, which I have to say was really exciting to listen to. So, yeah, before the intermission, so far these guys did really fantastically. Now as we came back from the intermission, they played four movements from Franz Schubert's Clavier Trio S. Dua. Now, I think that's supposed to mean E natural, but yeah, I'm not really sure which um, which really means E natural in German or or in or in that manner. But anyways, enough of that. Let's get on to 
the actual my actual thoughts on the last four movements from tonight from last night's concert allegro it was really lively and just overall gorgeous andante con moto as i said like beethoven's largo it was almost like a lullaby scherzo it was really a lot of fun to listen to and allegro moderato i really really love this because this is really a really appropriate finale for such a great concert like how it went from loud to soft and fast to slow and back to really 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 energetic and it's just it was just awesome really and after that the audience gave such a big round of applause it was just the greatest round of applause that I've ever heard in a concert hall and it really goes to show they really loved their performance now overall my experience with Prisma Kama Musique was absolutely unforgettable and they really really were well synchronized in their playing there were no qualms there were no setbacks it was absolute perfection all over the place and all I can say is that I have nothing but praise for them so here's a shout out to Kolya, Clemens, and Kirill. I wish you all a very long and prosperous career. I hope that you guys are still together after several years and we hope to hear more from you. Well, I have to get ready for a student film shoot today because um yeah it starts at 10:15 and all that so without further ado i hope you all have a nice day bye